So I have successfully transferred my file from Mega to my Google Drive without even any manual downloading. And if you also want to do it so within seconds, then this video is only for you. And for those who want a tutorial in Hindi language, they can surely check the link in the description or you can find it on i button. So let's start the video. Hello my friends, I welcome you in our today's video and in this tutorial we are going to see how you can transfer any file from your mega account to your google drive account and that too without any manual download which will save your time and also without much hassle. The steps are going to be very easy so watch the video till the end and consider liking this video. So I am here on my computer screen now and I'll open my default browser so I'll go to my chrome and here we have to search for multi cloud. So as soon as I search here, you have to click on the link at the top and here you have to click on get started for free. Now from here, I will log into it using my Google account and I select one of my account. It's loading right now. It might take a little bit of time and there is a pop up of the paid services too. So you have to go up here and cross it. Now the next thing you need to do is to open a new tab and do search for mega M E G A. Okay, so if you want to open your mega account, then by searching mega here, I can click on the link at the top. I'm considering that you have already your mega account logged in into your browser. And now we are going to open new tab again and I'll open my Google Drive in it. So here is my shortcut for drive. So I'll click on it and then my all three pages are open. Now I'll go back to multi cloud and here you will see some options on the side. So I go down here to my online services. There is an option of aid cloud here. So I'll click on it and now you have to share your Google Drive from here. Okay, listen to me. So you have to open the same account in this which you have opened in the drive. So my account is this one and I am going to select on it and proceed to login and it will ask for some permissions then you need to allow it it might take little loading time and now you can see whatever file is uploaded on my drive is showing here okay so i'll go to my google drive one more time and see i have all these things kept in my drive which mud cloud has done all of that now we need to link our mega account so i went back to the add cloud option in my online services here now instead of google drive you will see the option of mega here then i will click on it and it will ask me for my email and password here so i am going to put my email and password now the option of add mega is coming below so i click on it and see here it is showing the status of connecting and whatever files are saved in my mega is visible right now look at me i'll show my mega account again and here i have three files and also i have three files showing into my multi cloud so it is going to be a very easy process how can we transfer files in our google drive from mega so for example if i want to transfer the first file in the drive then i'll select it and see above here all these options then i'll go to the copy here and after clicking on it my google drive will be appear to me as we have already connected our google drive to the multi cloud so further you need to click on google drive here so it's selected and i click on ok here so it might take a little bit of time and now now it is showing the percentage of our file transferred into our google drive it may depend on your file size or your internet speed so here if we go to the detail view and the details are showing that our transfer has been successful then i'll cross from here and now i'll go and open my google drive uh, within my multi cloud so what was the file's name uh, it was a close up of woman works with a laptop so see here our file has come and is the one here and i go to my google drive over here and you can see your file and if it is not visible you need to refresh the google drive link and see just once here also our file has arrived so it has the same name on the file which we had transferred from our mega account using multi cloud and without even doing any manual download for it so just our process is completed right here and if you want to transfer like this from any other online accounts too then you will get all the other cloud services by going to the option add cloud here where cloud services of iphone is also available using which you can share your photos and files in google drive or any of your favorite cloud so that's all in this today's video and if our tutorial seemed helpful to you 
you then do like the video and subscribe us for more such amazing tutorials also please comment down the topic on which you want our next video on thank you